Welcome back, everybody. We're here on the small ship lineup review at maximum of 150 meters on Tuesdays. And Ace Face has come to join us today. And he's brought us this beautiful ship. So, what's it called, my, my friend? It's the Ghost Fighter MK3. The so, Ghost Fighter MK3. And there it is. The other, the other two versions were from the previous update. So, this is basically the second one. Just it's been refitted. updated again, yeah. It's a nice, interesting choice of the wedging here and the colors. It's very nice. It's like a minimal wedge, I guess. Yeah. Um, but you, I like how you've got the exposed systems. So, yeah, mm. tell us more about the ship. The. Okay, so it begins with the fact that, uh, you know, before they changed the turning speed, I had to always make ships as small as possible to, you know, obtain a decent turning speed. Yeah. But then, uh, you know, they changed it later, and it was okay to build bigger ships. So then, a few days ago, I thought, yeah, let's get back to this old ship and just try to make it a little bit better. Yeah. So, I added the new modules, the beam, and the damage, uh, uh, the machine gun with stop effect. Yeah, and its sole purpose is to raid people. It's you take the stop machine gun, fire at someone so they can't move, and then you just beam them. <laughs> and since it's so fast, and the overdrive module is a hundred percent, you can just fly all over the place with the radar jammer and not <laughs> yeah, be so detected. In other words, yeah, I understand. It's a really yeah. nice mix. I saw that computer at the back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, that's interesting. So what the um. Uh, it's hard to tell these days. I try not to linger over weapon performance because of the different server settings and whatnot. But basically, your strategy is stop and then laser burn them, and they can't yeah. see you because of the radar jammer. And you're really fast, so hopefully they can't even hit you. Yeah. Uh, yesterday, I was actually I saw some guy here streaming. It's uh, some guy called Danny P. He was streaming. Okay. And he had like his brother or friend. He anyway, they were playing on a server. And I just thought, oh, let's go and just sneak around with them with this ship. <laughs> and I actually went to them with this ship. <laughs> and uh, I pretty much just trolled them. <laughs> so it did very well but, then, basically. Yeah, it did yeah. very well until somehow its turret just shot a missile and blew it with this one hit. Yeah, that's so what happens. Died. Yeah, that's what happens eventually to the fighters. But still, you know, if you had a bunch of bros, you could do a lot of damage. Yeah, exactly. But Sounds so like. Maybe um, take out, maybe a contender for a Nolsec operation one day. We can yeah, make a exactly. squadron of these, get a bunch of pilots. That'd be cool. Alright, well, I... is there anything else you want to tell me about it before I finish off? Because you're, I think, the last guy today. Uh, No, nothing really. Alright, well, first of all, thanks for bringing the ship and coming along. Um, that's, Thank you. like I say, the main thing. I appreciate people who bothered to show, so it's nice. And, and it's um, also fun to be coming back to Mushroom Fleet for after a long while. Yeah, yeah, definitely. It's good to see you back. So uh, thanks again to everybody watching. And of course, I'll see you all next time. Bye-bye.